Well, guys, I got this uh, Chinese little diesel engine I bought off of Amazon. I am a little concerned, though. It looked like it's been riding upside down in the box. So, let's see what she looks like here. When it was delivered to my step, it was upside down. So, so far, so good, it looks like. Let me get it out of the box here. Okay. I had a long journey. Looked like it was riding the right side up for a while. Then they flipped it over. Yeah, that's what she looks like right now, unpacking. Not the greatest packing done ever. We'll see if there's any obvious issues. Looks pretty good right now. So... If you can read Chinese, I think this is like a 200 and some CC. <clears throat> we'll get that strainer out of there. So I got her all cleaned up with the vacuum. <clears throat> I'm looking at it. Here's your fuel line to the mechanical injection pump. Pumps it up here to the injector. Uh, my concern was is there going to be a filter? I don't see no filter, but looking inside there, I'll look into it here. And there is a filter on the bottom. So that's, that's good news there. Let's we'll see what that'll consist of here. I may put a filter in line also. It looks like we might be able to change that filter out, but we shall see. Okay, so that's what the top of the little filter looks like. There's like a little plastic grab hose and then it goes down. So I would assume you can get in there with a needle nose and grab that strainer out of there possibly but I think I'm gonna put another inline one in just to be safe. Next we're gonna check out what their filter looks like on here. And we got some packing units here. Looks like a solid little air filter that probably won't ever be able to find a replacement for I guess. And it looks like they got a crankcase vent here. Uh, no hose on it. At least it wasn't on this one. I'll look in the box a little detailed. Maybe it fell off. Here's your decompression. Do you have to add oil to it? I'm assuming that's what that means. I checked there. There's no oil in it at all. And this appears to be the throttle. Pulls this little lever back there. Make it go faster, evidently. We'll have to make that a little bit better for the tiller that we're gonna put this on, I think. Well, I took the exhaust off here, the muffler. It does appear to look like they do test fire them. There's a little soot there. So that's good to know that it probably runs. Okay, we're gonna go for a start on this old girl. It's an old Troy built pony, I believe. Replace the Briggs and put the old Chinese diesel on there. See how she sounds. Compression release. We'll idle it up a little bit. Let this
We're going to try her in the field. Okay guys, we got it done, tilling, got her nice and hot, everything burned out. You might want to know what I was running for oil, 1540 is what I added. Uh, it worked good, boy, done it for about 30 minutes. It did not blow up yet, so uh, stay tuned. Uh, if it decides to, I'll make another video, maybe check back in a year or so, we'll see how it is. Uh, I will put the comment or the uh, Amazon link in the uh, description, and you, if you want, you can buy it there. I did find out there is one bolt missing though. I gotta add it. I'm sure that's a metric, but uh, anyway, it works good for what it is. We don't have to worry about fuel getting bad, carburetor getting bad. There's no carburetor. It's all diesel. She's noisy, but it works. Keep your earplugs in. Thanks for watching everyone. And I did forget to mention, if you were gonna put another filter in here, I was just gonna cut this line right here. Splice filter in so you can see how dirty it is and if this one isn't tight enough.